anti-Trump comedian who spends much of his segments focusing on attacking the president ironically believes the Democrat Party 2020 platform is too focused on Trump and not who Democrats are. Trevor Noah has big plans when it comes to covering President Donald Trump and the Democrats in the 2020 election cycle on The Daily Show. What's going to be interesting for me in 2020 is this new narrative and this new discussion around the Democratic Party, because for a long time it's just been one storyline, Donald Trump, Noah, 35, said at a VSXSW panel via The Hollywood Reporter. But now it's going to be, who are the Democrats? What do they stand for? What are their plans? We're going to be at the conventions, we're going to be tracking the primaries," the South African-born comedian revealed. We're going to go wherever there's access. While Noah looks forward to covering the election cycle, he admits that another cycle baffles him, the 24-hour news cycle, especially when it comes to cable news. What we've come to realize is there is no news cycle, there is no schedule, there is no plan, no admitted, according to The Hollywood Reporter. When I had just taken over from Jon Stewart, the news cycle had a cadence to it. There was a rhythm, so you knew that at a certain time there would be no news, so you could create a show. Now, there is a 5.30 p.m. curse, we call it. At 5.30 p.m. somebody is getting indicted, some tweet is coming out, somebody is getting into some scandal, something is going to happen. Dotty added, we create the show for the day and we know full well that there's a good chance at 5 p.m. we'll have to throw out most of the show and then create something new, and we've gotten good at it. Despite the Daily Show being a Comedy Central staple, Noah does take his role as its anchor seriously and hopes to be at least somewhat informative during his tenure behind the desk. Video. Our journey on The Daily Show is figuring out how to inform you on what's actually going on, Noah said. One of the biggest things that frustrates me in America is that when I watch cable news is that I don't know what's going on. Noah explained that in South Africa, news channels rarely have commentators or opinion segments, leading him to question what he watches stateside when it comes to election coverage. He expressed some frustration at the lack of serious coverage of candidates' platforms and issues and the focus on frivolous aspects of candidates' lives and personality quirks. It shouldn't be about how you eat a corn dog. It should be about how to treat Americans who eat too many corn dogs with health care, he said. That's what our journey is going to be now, is accurately giving you the story of what is going on. If you watch The Daily Show, I would like you to be able to go to your voting station knowing what your candidate stands for or against. That's the one I'd like to do, is just focus on policy. I think a lot of the time I think it's easy to get caught up in the things that offend people and not the things that affect people.